The topic for today is badla in stock market. What does it mean? Carry forward of settlement is called badla. Now, supposingly, you go in the market to buy a shirt. The shirt is for one thousand rupees. You like the shirt. You want to make the payment and take the delivery of the shirt. But what if you don't have money right now? You don't have money, one thousand rupees, to buy that shirt. Is it possible that you tell the seller that okay, we are pushing the date of our purchase. I will come after ten days and I'll pick this shirt and pay you one thousand rupees. So what you did was you selected the item and you pushed the date of purchase and also you pushed the date of delivery as well. Something similar when it happens in stock market is called badal. It is the carry forward of settlement. It is a facility that allows the postponement of delivery. Just I to as I told you in this example that you are not going to carry that shirt home, right? The delivery of the item is postponed. Here, our items are the shares and the stock. You cannot carry your stock home. The share certificate won't be delivered to you. The delivery is postponed. And of course, what else is postponed is the payment of transaction. The whole deal is pushed a little further. It is a facility. Listen again. That allows the postponement of the delivery or the payment of the transaction. Neither you pay nor you pick the item, but that deal is pushed from one settlement period to the other settlement period. It is pushed a little further. Using the badla tool, the investor can carry forward his position on payment of small margin. Now, why will that person block that particular item for you? You have to pay a little extra if you want to keep that item reserved for you. So what is that? This is the payment of small margin. You have to pay him a little, right? Even if you go to the market to buy a shop, uh, you go to the shop to buy an item. He will just fix that item. He will book that item for you. Okay, you come after say two days and pick this item, but you have to give a little token, little deposit. So that is called here in stock market. The investor can carry forward his position. You can push forward the settlement, but you have to pay a little margin. Now, badla is the charge which the investor pays to carry forward his position because you are going to push the settlement. You are going to carry forward that deal, so you will be paying a little extra, and that charge is called badla. Right now, here we try to understand the deal in the stock market happens through the broker. Right, this is your broker. One is the buyer. buyer of the securities one is the seller and there is the broker so whatever deal is going to happen between the buyer and the seller is going to happen through this broker the buyer also is going to contact the broker and so is the seller also going to contact the broker the deal is going to be executed through the broker clear now let me give you an example see the july 27 deal happens between the buyer and the seller with the intermediary called broker deal happens the stock price is 4 lakh rupees okay the buyer says i don't have money right now the settlement if every if they, he had the money the settlement expected to be on 29th july you know t plus 1 right now money shall be given and the shares will be delivery will be done this is what is the regular feature that on 27th of july the deal price is 4 lakh rupees settlement to be done till 29th this fellow will be giving the money this fellow will be giving the shares through the broker now what if happens that the buyer says i don't have money this person is saying i don't have money so the deal is being pushed under badla badla means pushing the deal a little forward now the date decided is 2nd of august that okay on 2nd of august we both will come i will pay you and we'll take the delivery of the stock so you know how radical randomly the prices go up and down now on 2nd of august the price of the same stock rises to 7 lakh instead of 4 lakh it has risen to 7 lakh what will happen in this case the seller will refuse to execute the deal there is a lot of difference between 4 lakh and 7 lakh are you getting the point 
seller will be ready to pay the compensation margin money and interest now if you push the deal a little further you have to pay the charges called badla because the prices has risen from 4 lakh to 7 lakh the seller he will say oh my god you keep the margin money you keep the interest i'll pay you the badla also but i will not let the deal to be executed so this is showing that there's a lot of risk now what if in the second scenario what if on 2nd august the price of the same stock which was 4 lakh now it falls to 2 lakh just as i told you the prices keep on rising and falling now in this case the buyer will refuse to execute the deal he will say you keep the margin money you keep the badla charges but no deal is going to take place because the price has fallen to 2 lakh now in both these cases the broker had to suffer in order to maintain his reputation he may have to pay from his own pocket right so it was very tough for the broker this carry forward is done at the make up price usually the closing price of the last settlement you have to pay a extra na you have to pay a little extra if you want to book that shirt in the market if you are pushing the deal further you'll have to pay a little extra a badla transaction affects the following payments or the charges the first is the margin money the money paid while buying the shares will definitely go they will not be returned secondly the badla charges another name for that is contago this is the percentage price paid by the buyer of the stock to postpone the transfer to a future settling day you know if the buyer is interested to push the deal a little further to future days he will have to pay a little extra that is called the badla charges okay and another name is the contagio it is paid by the buyer of the stock because it is his interest he wants to push the deal further because he does not have the money right now to pay to the intermediary which is the broker are you getting it now the badla transactions are no longer valid in india they are not there they don't exist right now badla had these disadvantages that it encouraged speculation you know people may be speculating that the money may vary on the future date so that is why they are not ready to execute the deal it was basically meant when the buyer did not have the money to pay to the intermediary but people may have the money with their in their pocket to pay to the intermediary but still for speculative purposes also they may be interested to push the deal a little further see now deal is of 2 lakh what if the stock rose to 5 lakhs the buyer will not be willing to execute the deal he may be ready to forgo the compensation he will say keep the money no way, no worries the broker was always in the back position in this case when the badla was there the broker was in the back position if either party defaults the broker had to pay from his pocket broker had to keep money ready his money got blocked okay so this comes to the end of the article i hope i have made the things very clear to you in case you have any doubts please feel free to ask me in the comment section like and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching stay safe stay blessed